From Toy Story's bold adventure to silly Monsters Inc. antics, Pixar films have made us laugh and cry for years. Now you can see just how much work goes into these iconic films at the Museum of Science and Industry's new exhibit, The Science Behind Pixar. I just thought like they, they just drew a picture and put it on the screen, not, not like it took so long just to make one slide of it. Inside the exhibit, kids like eight-year-old Madeline Bell try to mimic the pros, coasting around to tweak animations, create their own designs, and learn about different degrees of detail needed based on where the camera is pointed. Everything from computer engineering as well as traditional process where you can make a model and then see how that gets turned into a 3D image and then back into a 2D image through the rendering process. The hands-on displays give visitors a taste of Pixar's special processes like rigging, which is the skeleton joints and muscles that are designed to make characters move in specific ways after their rough shapes are thought up. Rigging isn't just about how characters move, it's about how they feel too. In fact, the exhibit says there may be hundreds of controls just in a character's face to help show emotion. After the characters and scenery are designed, Pixar still has to take care of traditional film challenges like lighting and camera angles, all done in a digital space. Both of our daughters really like science and math, and so to see the, what it takes to get to the finished product and how much of that science and math plays a role is, is very nice for us to be able to do. Plus, you get to add your own sense of style to Pixar's iconic look. The science behind Pixar is at the Museum of Science and Industry until January 6th, so make sure you come check it out before it races off to infinity and beyond. In Hyde Park, Jesse Kirsch, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.